Hello there. This is my review of the Smith's Everest. This is the newest model with the Myota 9039 movement. And what I'm interested in is not so much how it looks, it does look rather gorgeous in my opinion, obviously homage to the you know, Rose Explorer, an extremely small uh, fraction of the cost. Is actually does it actually work very well because obviously a watch has to do what a watch does which is tell the time and I think this does it in an exceptionally clean and delicate manner it's 36 mil rather dinky it's extremely uh, narrow I can show you okay and um, let's have a look to see if it actually tells the time any good so here we've got a time grapher Pop it on there, one moment. Now here is in the time grapher, face down. You can see that is very respectable. Nice flat line, absolutely as accurate as it can possibly be. Very healthy amplitude, 278, zero beat error, and that's the correct beat. Ah, one slight problem. Uh, this does not have a 52 degree uh, lift angle. It actually has a 51 degree F lift angle from the motor sheets. Motor sheets has so quickly addressed that. We can tell that is the frequency 28800, so we can set that. There we are. The lift angle is 51 degrees. There we are. So let's get that right. And let's try again. That's a little bit quieter, isn't it? So as you can see, that is a face down. This is a pretty error. To face up. Let it settle. That's better. And again, a very nice trace. Almost zero beat error. Zero seconds. So what I'm trying to tell you there is that this little motor movement is pretty solid at whatever position you 